And outside Africa, Australian Prime Minister Scott Morris says China must act in its declaration of promoting world peace and join the effort to stop Russia's invasion of Ukraine, warning that the world is in danger of being reshaped by an era of autocracy. China has declined to call the Russian attack on Ukraine an invasion, while asking Western countries to respect Russia's legitimacy legitimate security concerns. It has called for a solution to the crisis through negotiations. The crisis that now grips Europe heralds a moment of choice for China, the Chinese government and leadership. Under Mr Putin, Russia has chosen the path of violence and seeking to overturn the global order. The world has heard China's words about its commitment to global peace and respect for sovereignty and territorial integrity and playing a positive role in the international community for a very long time now. So it's now up to China and their leaders at this hinge point of history to demonstrate that these are more than just words. No country would have a greater impact right now on Russia's violent aggression towards Ukraine than China joining the rest of the world in denouncing Russia's aggression and applying the same sanctions we have. So far, they have not. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.